Hey guys, Casey Foster here from NetcodeGuys.com. Just going to show you guys a quick overview of the map, DE Nukes, the one that was released in the fire uh, operation um, on uh, the 17th, which was today. Um, so obviously we have the newest version of Nuke that is in um, rotation. It may be in the map pool, it may not be. Um, it may get a little, a few tweaks. Um, because there's definitely a few things that I've noticed that are going to make this extremely T-sided. Um, so anyway, here we are. We're going to get into it now. This is obviously uh, coming out of CT Spawn, and this is Heaven. Um, so obviously, as you can see, there is a platform here. Um, and it's got a pretty sweet like uh, air conditioning thing here that is going to give you all kinds of cover to potentially take fights at um, posting on outside. And you can also use it to get up onto this ledge. Um, sorry, I guess you can't jump there, but you can jump up through this little hole here. Um, this is obviously catwalk and the difference is it goes down here and then look at that. Boom. It connects all the way to outside. So as terrorists, when they jump up on the silo, they can basically just drop on this ledge and get all the way around and get into heaven. Um, they had to, you had to do a boost off of the, the, okay. And from here you had to jump on a little, uh, thing that was actually on the wall right about here. And you had to double, you had to have somebody stand on it and you boosted, and then you had to run and air strafe around and land on this thing that was up there. So anyway, they've made it extremely easy for you to get on silo as well. Um, with this very simple, just a little jump up on this thing and you can jump up on the corner and then you're on silo. So that is extremely easy. Now it requires zero skill. Um, and then you can drop down to this position. You can fight the guys outside and you can ultimately get into heaven relatively easy. Um, they have also changed hut and mini, um, and the vents. So they've obviously done away with Okay, and they've obviously done away with the far vent, and we still have the close vent. Um, and what that's going to do is it's going to remove a possibility of a player playing in this area, someone opening vents, him dropping down vents, and then getting into this position here. So um, that makes it a little bit more T-sided. And then this also makes it a little bit more T-sided, which is relatively new as well. Well, this is actually from Source. Um, where you could open up backhaul and you could go all the way around. Um, they removed this from go and they had a toxic door and all that it was is a little hole in the wall right there. Um, this is actually from something from source, which makes it very easy to clutch downstairs because you can plant the bomb and run up this way and come into the vents and shoot and come back out hall and come back over here. Um, it makes it really easy to clutch in the lower bomb site. Um, obviously they've done away with the other side of this vent um right here so there's only one way to come out of the vent and it's here and there's only one vent to go in this is the t-sided vent um another thing that's going to make this extremely t-sided as well is the upper a uh the upper bomb site hits so as you can see from the upper uh upper heaven they've kept the same ledges and they have this beam to cross the site here, but they've put these these bars here. And these bars, I, at first, I thought were just the aesthetic things and things that you were going to have to air strafe around. But they've actually removed the ledges here. So that you see the ledges, but you actually can't stand on them. If you no-clip onto it, like this. See, I'm, I, should, I should land on this ledge right about here, and it just shoots me off. So you actually cannot go on that ledge, which is going to make the upper bomb site extremely vulnerable. All that's going to happen every round is the terrorists are just going to run straight into this position. And they don't have to worry about anybody in any of this position here. All they have to worry about is somebody here, here, and here. Which, upper nuke, literally two people could hold a five-man rush because there were so many places to check. So with with the uh, with the removal of the ability to stand on these ledges, that just opens up opens up the bomb site so much easier. I'm sure these sky... Yeah, you can definitely flash through these as well. So it's literally going to be... A very even map I would think with with how with how outside is looking with being able to jump onto the ledge up there um, from from uh, silo and get all the way around and get outer map control like look how close these gunfights are like outer on nuke used to be like 13,000 miles now this is like not very far at all so with the changes of removing the ledges like the the opposite side, we used to just call it, you know, above CT side event. Um, with the removal of the ability to be there, that's definitely going to make seat, uh, make the upper bomb site a very, very viable bomb site um, as a terrorist to hit. 
and um, getting down lower, you're going to be winning more rounds as a terrorist, being able to clutch with those those uh, those doors, uh, being able to go around back halls, and then also the outside that ledge is going to make it so easy to. Um, oh, you can't close these. Oh, you can't. Okay. Um, that's going to make it so easy to get outside, especially with how easy it is to get onto silo. Like you're going to be seeing like two and three people up there, just like getting onto this ledge and trading a kill out here, and then getting into heaven. Like this is totally going to be a uh like a eight seven nine six kind of half not like an eleven four or a freaking you know fourteen to one kind of sided half so um they've also added this little ledge this little uh metal beam here so you can't just come straight out of uh hut and just shoot this guy that's going to be right here you now have to jump over this ledge um which is going to penalize you in the air you're not gonna be able to shoot maybe you have a pump or something to take that fight um but it definitely changes changes the upper bomb site and um I would, I'm, I'm definitely going to go out on a whim and say that there's going to be many more uh, many more rounds won on T side with these changes to the new DE nuke. So anyway, let me know what you guys think of the new nuke in the comments below. We may see some changes in the future with it. We may not. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks.